How to Enjoy Whiskey and Cigars, Episode 3, Glassware. Does it matter what kind of glass you drink your whiskey from? Well, your experience can vary depending on what you're drinking from. So to maximize the input to your senses, then yes, choosing the right glass option is a significant factor. A glass with a tapered or tulip top will act as a chimney flue and allow the vapors and scents of the whiskey to concentrate so you can easily sniff the top of the glass and learn a lot about the whiskey in the glass. An example of that is this Glen Cairn glass introduced in 2001. It's used in distilleries, whiskey bars, and by whiskey enthusiasts everywhere. Uh, in addition to facilitating the collection of the aromas at the top of the glass, it also dissipates the ethanol or alcohol so that it doesn't get in the way of your enjoyment of understanding the nature of that particular whiskey. Uh, this is my go-to glass for whiskey tasting, particularly with a whiskey I've never tried before. I try it neat in one of these and I learn a lot about it right away. If you prefer to drink your whiskey on the rocks, then this short, large diameter glass allows the use of ice cubes or larger ice balls. You can drink whiskey neat as well with a rocks glass, of course. But if you prefer to have not so much influence through your nose, then this is a better choice. Um, and there's nothing wrong with drinking whiskey out of a rocks glass. I do it often myself. There's another variation, relatively new. It's known as a whiskey glass. Here's an example of one. Uh, I've seen it called an American whiskey glass. I've heard it called a bourbon glass. Essentially, it's about the same height as the rocks glass but it flares out a little bit at the top. And that again uh, allows the vapors to dissipate somewhat um, and to get the collection of the, the flavors, scents uh, at the top so that when you nose it, you still get something out of it. Not as good as a Glen Cairn glass for nosing a whiskey, but for bourbons in particular, I think this is a great choice for rise. Um, so I'd give this one a shot as well. Um, you know, I always believe you, you want to drink whiskey the way you want, out of whatever glass you want. I may prefer a Glen Cairn glass, particularly for scotch, for example. Um, I might prefer to drink bourbon out of a rocks glass or even a whiskey glass. And that's fine. You may find that yourself, that for different whiskeys, you want to use a different glass. Now, whatever choice you make, it's sure to enhance your experience. Uh, another reason for choosing a different type of glass might be if you're trying to pair it with cigars. You may find one glass gives you a different experience than a different one, and it may pair better with a cigar or a given cigar. So uh, mix it up, do some experimenting. Um, you'll learn a lot more about your tastes in whiskey and, and glasses as well, I guess. Next up, we're going to talk about drinking higher proof whiskeys.